Hey. No matter what happens out here, I need my best gun on this in case things go south. Can I depend on you? Just tell me what to do, Cap. Our weapons haven't been fired in nearly a century. Why don't you head over to Yakov and get your gear checked, and then be prepared to move out as soon as those probes are located. Any questions? No word from Earth, I assume? It's really gone. She went dark 15 years into our journey. More or less as predicted. ECA's confirmed no communication since. <laughs> Shit. You know, I uh, grew up a slum dog, fighting for scraps. Lost everyone, really. Long before the end. Doomsday just wasn't a thing I worried about. Hell, it was never gonna live past 20 anyway. Somehow, <laughs> I was one of the ones who made it. Don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing here. If things go right, time's coming. You're gonna have to leave all that behind. This is a new beginning. You could have a family here. Build a cabin. Grow old and get fat. That's not me, Cap. Know my way around bullets, not kids. There's gonna be no need for someone like me here. Maybe the old you, Outrider. But you're one of the chosen few. You get to build the future. Don't waste it. Did any more of your people make it off Earth, Cap? My brother. Almost. But no. They got him in cryo as we evacuated L.A., hoping we could stop the bleeding. Ah, he was too far gone. Ah, shit. Sorry to hear that. I haven't had the time to think about it. What about Sarah? She's good, right? Yeah. My Sarah's up there. They don't wake her group for another six months, but I can wait. I'm, uh... I didn't have a chance to tell you this and all the madness, but my little girl's pregnant. That's how I got her the seat. <laughs> Two for one special, huh? So that's why I've been in such a good mood since they unfroze your ass. Don't push it out right. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, granddad, sir. I'll go find Jakob's shooting range. Good. We're on standby for those probes, so stay on alert. <laughs> 